Alright guys, this is Number Munchers. This was a game that was played in a lot of computer labs way back in the day. I remember playing it at school, I think in about third grade. Um, and I'm leery about playing these math games because I'm afraid it's going to show off my my lack of oh, my lack of basic math skills. So let's see, I'm looking for everything that equals one. Well, what else am I missing? Okay, yeah, anything divided. Hooray! Anything that equals two. <laughs> okay. This is a stupid game, man. Alright, let's see. This is the toggle. But I'll show you what I mean here in a second. You were eaten by a troglus normalus. Yeah, here we go. Muncher Troggle. I seem to remember them knocking off the whole introduction to Miss Pac-Man where it introduces each one of the monsters. But I can't get it to do it now. Oh well. Um, there was a lot of stuff that they uh, ran through computer labs and there was a lot of not a lot of, but several different educational programs that came out at the time. Um, of course, the two most oops, crap, the two most popular were this one and uh, the Oregon Trail. But of the math games, the math games in particular were some of them were pretty crazy. Um, I'm s pretty impressed, even by today's standards, that gameplay-wise they were able to come up with something that was, um, we'll say, innovative. I guess. But in the end, it's number munchers. If you're from that era, you probably played it as a kid. And that's really where it stops. <laughs> and I think that's where I'm going to stop before I flex any more of my poor math skills. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next one. If I can figure out how to get out of here. No! Die! <laughs>